This short video explains proposals 2, 3 and 4 set out in Cheshire Fire Authority's Draft Community Risk Management Plan 2024-28. These proposals relate to changing the way we staff some of our fire engines. Our firefighters respond to fires, road traffic collisions and other emergencies from 28 fire stations across Cheshire. Some of these have one fire engine and some have two. Other stations have specialist vehicles like aerial ladder platforms, rapid response rescue units or boats depending on the risks in their areas. These risks also determine the way we staff our fire stations. In busy urban areas, stations are staffed 24-7 by full-time firefighters, ready to respond at any time. In quieter rural areas, our firefighters are on call. They are part-time and live or work within five minutes of their fire station and carry pagers to alert them to incidents. And some fire stations have a combination of full-time and on-call firefighters. We aim to get to incidents as quickly as possible, regardless of where they happen. To achieve this, we need to be flexible. That's because our 35 fire engines are not all available at the same time. Sometimes firefighters need to train. Sometimes they are busy at larger incidents that require more fire engines. And sometimes fire engines are unavailable because on-call firefighters have other commitments. To help us get to incidents within 10 minutes, we constantly move our fire engines around the county. The way we do that changes day to day, depending on how many fire engines are available. Sometimes this is a challenge. At the moment, we can only guarantee 17 fire engines will be available during our busiest daytime hours, and 15 when we are quieter at night. We are proposing to make three changes to the way we staff some of our fire engines to make sure more are available to respond to emergencies and carry out work in the community. First, we want to convert four on-call fire engines to full-time crewing during weekdays. Runcorn, Winsford, Northwich and Macclesfield fire stations each have two fire engines. One is crewed by full-time firefighters and the other by on-call firefighters. These on-call fire engines are often unavailable during the day because there are not always enough on-call firefighters available to respond at the same time. Instead of being on-call 24-7, we want these fire engines to be crewed by full-time firefighters during busy daytime hours only, Monday to Friday. They would be weekday daytime fire engines, operating mainly in areas where on-call fire engines tend to be unavailable during the day. The new daytime fire engine from Runcorn might operate around Frodham and Tarpley, but also in other areas where it is needed. The new daytime fire engine from Winsford is likely to operate around Middlewich, Holmes Chapel, Sandbatch and Olsager. The new daytime fire engine from Northwich could operate in Malpas, Nantwich and Audlam, among other places. And the new daytime fire engine from Macclesfield would operate mostly in Bollington and Poynton. In these areas, response times would improve when on-call firefighters are not available. The new crews would also be able to carry out more home safety visits and business safety inspections. Runcorn, Winsford, Northwich and Macclesfield would continue to be served by full-time fire engines 24 hours a day, 7 days a week. On-call firefighters would continue to staff Macclesfield's principal fire engine at night, as they do now, but there would no longer be on-call firefighter posts at Runcorn, Winsford and Northwich. However, many of these are vacant and others are held by people who are already full-time firefighters. We would aim to redeploy the small number of colleagues affected. Second, we want to convert Nutsford's fire engine from on-call to day crewing. Nutsford currently has an on-call fire station, but its fire engine is not available as much as we would like. We want the station to be day crewed, meaning it would be staffed for 10 hours a day, Monday to Friday. At nights and weekends, firefighters would be on call and respond from their houses across the road from the fire station. Four of our other fire stations already operate like this. This would improve our response time in Nutsford and enable us to carry out more home safety visits and business safety inspections. Finally, we want to reorganise daytime fire cover in Warrington. 
Warrington area is served by five fire stations, Warrington, Stockton Heath, Birchwood, Penketh and Lim. Witness and Runcorn are also nearby. Stockton Heath is an on-call fire station, but its fire engine is hardly ever available during the day. If an incident happens in this area, one of the neighbouring fire stations responds, usually well within our 10 minute target. Birchwood Fire Station is staffed by full-time firefighters in the day and on-call firefighters at night. We want Stockton Heath and Birchwood to work together as one. Their fire engines would take turns to be on duty for 12 hours each day. Stockton Heath's would be available for 50% of daytimes, then Birchwood's the other 50%. At night, Birchwood would continue to have an on-call fire engine. Stockton Heath would be covered by nearby fire stations, including Lim and Warrington, as they are now when the on-call fire engine is not available. There would be several benefits. The Warrington area would still have four full-time fire engines all day, every day. The difference is that one would alternate between two fire stations. Stockton Heath's fire engine would have a guaranteed fire engine 50% of daytimes. The new daytime crew would also be able to carry out more home safety visits and business safety inspections in the area. We own a number of houses in Stockton Heath for on-call firefighters. We propose to sell these and use the money to help upgrade and replace dated fire stations. We believe these three changes will significantly improve our service to the community. We would keep the same number of fire stations and fire engines as we have now. More fire engines would be guaranteed available on weekdays, weekends and overnight. The average time it takes to respond to incidents would improve. We would visit more people at risk of fire in their homes. We would visit more business premises to help them reduce the risk of fire. And overall, this new way of working is affordable within our existing budget. What do you think? To read about our proposals in more detail and to share your views, please visit cheshirefire.gov.uk. Our consultation closes on the 2nd of January 2024. Thanks for watching and listening.